Hey everyone, we're back! My name is Miss Scarlet Tanager, and I am playing some Remothered Broken Porcelain demo. Now, we're still having some bullshit. I wish it had a little bit more autosaving going on, but it doesn't. Sadly. Alright. So I'm still at this point. It works! Why would you speak? She is right the hell there. Okay, two, one, three. Counts fine. What the hell? I have to make sure not to get caught. Oh god, I hope they don't find out. Don't say anything then! She's right there! This is supposed to be a hotel. But it feels more like an orphan. It's coming from room 213. No, it's not! No one? Definitely not me. Shh, as long as she stays up there, I'm fine. I'm Gucci. This is all good. I'm not gonna die this time. No, no, no. I'm not gonna die horrifically. I'm probably going to die horrifically. Okay, she's gone back in there. And that means... It would be best if I just told him I don't work with crybabies. Yeah, about that. Not a crybaby jerk face. Okay. I also know that um, I figured out a little bit of the door janking problem. The, there's the enter and exit interact button, and they don't like to work together, in my experience. So I click this, and she goes inside just fine. But sometimes when it does a little when it does a little zoom in thing, I have to do the exit interaction button before it'll actually sort of work correctly. So Eliza's gone. I shouldn't have encouraged Lynn to take part in Lynn. the contest. Or whatever. And maybe I wouldn't have almost lost an arm. What was going through your the head? Is your... So that's how she almost so that's how she got um, injured. Locked. Okay, so that's locked. That's a hide spot, it looks like. It's a bathroom. Why do you need to do a thing for the bathroom? Just... I swear to God. Go through the door. Just when I thought I figured something out. It's like, no! I don't want to. Okay. There we go. What? Okay! <laughs> I feel like that should have had sounds to it. Oh, there's a safe there. I figured there would have been a sound there that would have brought the stalker, but I guess not. There's no power. It won't work. Access the balcony. Okay, so I have to access the balcony. Uh, if you forgot your code for technical assistance, call 62131. So I have to use the phone again. Excellent! Hold on, I'm just gonna grab myself a sticky note. Because yes, I have a stack of sticky notes for when I'm Let's Play games and I need to remember codes like this because I have a terrible, terrible memory. Let's see. Six, two, one, three, one. Excellent. I assume I have to use that. Yeah, 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 that's forked. Oh, wait! Electrical cable! The, um, um... So I need to restore the power, and I need to use the phone. Okay. I get you. Oh, wait, that's her over there. For a second, I was like, wait a minute, what? I'm a little injured. I can't remember if I can heal that or not. Oh well. I just have to not get caught. Not here. It would be best if I just told him. Okay. I don't work with crybabies. Six? Two? 
one, three, one. In order to factory reset your safe, oh, shit. insert the following code. Okay. Three. Three. Two. Two. One. One. Four. Four. Cool. So there's that. Now I just have to go use the electrical cable. Uh, this is not the time. This is, this is not the... This is not the time! Thank you. <laughs> still, still, I'm working on it. I'm working on it. Hopefully a little bit of the jank is cleared up. Once the actual game gets released. Getting a little better at it. Alright. I'm pretty sure I'm not behind that locker. I bet you anything. Yes, yes, please. Yes, I did. Oh, it. that's how I do it. I get it now. I think I get how I do um the defense thing. Maybe. Maybe I get how I do the defense thing now. We'll see if I get caught again. Okay. Got a bad feeling about this. No? Okay, cool. She is still in there sewing. For a second I was concerned. I told Ashman that we didn't need desperate children. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Bye, crazy lady! I'm just a little bit injured. This is fine. This is fine. Nothing could possibly go wrong. This is fine. <laughs> this is totally fine. Nothing's fine. Nope. Everything's fine. Okay. I need to check behind me. I have seen better days. Oh no. What could the code be? Oh, I know what the code is. I've already figured it out. Uh. Oh, jeez. This is weird. Three? Two, one, four. Yes, yes, yes! Don't trust it. Anytime anything makes it sound, I'm like, mm, not trusting it. Okay. The French window. This is fine. <sighs> it's freezing. Then maybe don't be out here, silly. Can't see me. Super sneaks. What's that? A moth key. Are those collectibles? I'm freezing. You're fine. You got long sleeves on. That's something. Wait a minute. She was totally sewing. How? How has she seen you? That makes no sense. Window. I must find a way to reach it. This is fine. No, 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 no. Come on. We don't have forever, lady. <laughs> I made it. I can do it. I can do it. Can you? Maybe you should stop talking and you know start doing. Uh-oh. Hi, birds! How are you? What are all these cages? Whoa, why am I still running? Oh, that's weird. They're birds, obviously. Along with creepy singing! Another moth key. Uh. Can't. There we go. A bottle. Click a thingy. A thingy. Many much thingies. Corrosive. Ooh, yes, please. Ashman's sister. Yeah, Gloria, the person that I murdered in the first game with extreme prejudice. Felton. Gallo. Wait a minute. 
the mirror. Wait a minute! I saw it. What's going on, kids? Mommy is coming. This is fine. <laughs> this is fine. <laughs> so that that looked like the super sharp spinal thing from the first game that the red nun was using, but the red nun is Gloria. So now I don't know what's going on. <gasps> I need that. Mommy is exhausted. One of these days, you're all going to make me crazy. Okay. So if I use a master key, I can get into the- this is a nightmare. You're fine. I have to be quiet. She's gonna wake up. There's no way she doesn't. Especially because it's not letting me sneak right now. Yeah, it's not letting me sneak. Okay. I think I did it right. Yeah, no, she's gonna- Take the fucking key, idiot! We gotta go! God damn it! I don't know what I'm doing! Wait, what? If you can get close enough without being spotted, you can attack them. Hit them to make them fall to the ground for a while. Use it to your advantage. So I have to knock her down. Great! Oh! Ah, uh, what are you doing? <laughs> Game? Oh! I did it! So I was right! I got it! I can do this! the keys. Thank you. Oh shit. Um, hi! Can we knock this off please? Be nice. Uh, can't see. Thank you. Ow! Rude. Oh, she's still chasing me. You gotta go! Or don't. Or like don't. Come on. Get her! Okay. This is fine. Oh. Okay. Get it. Excellent. So I assume that goes to the stairwell because I have to get to the lobby, so I'm just gonna. Yeah. Seems. Seems legit. I get the fuck out of here. Hi! There! There! It has the spinal column looking sharpie thing that the, uh... Oh, hey. That's less than ideal. But it has this, it has the sharpened spinal column-y thing from... That the red... Or that the red nun uses in the first game. That is absolutely what that is. Let's occasionally remember. And now because of that, uh, victory tea. Some years later. Okay. Is this the end of the demo? Still no news regarding last night's massacre at the peaceful residence of Cervo Scuro, where the body of Richard Felton, a well known notary, was found burnt in his own home. <laughs> that lip sync the man is terrible. Who was registered as Jennifer Richard Dean so this is after the first game now. Completely drenched in kerosene. The body of 38 year old Gloria Ashman was also found at the scene. She was his personal assistant and a former nun at the Cristo Morente convent. Her body was found mutilated as she was reported thrown out a courtyard facing window, apparently. Hey, it's Rosemary! The neighbors claimed to have spotted a distinctive woman lurking around the area, having parked a white van nearby. Who has changed her hairstyle because she done goofed. Or, well, she didn't done goof. I mean, she did because she broke and entered the building in the first place. Mr. Right Ashman is waiting for you. 
Did you say Reed? Are you a relative? Eh. More like an old family friend. It's the same voice actress, too. Cool. Please come in, Miss Reed. Come in. She definitely got a haircut. Don't be afraid. I don't bite. And her hair looks not as poofy. And shorter. What is Reed? A pun? Okay. Good evening, Mr. Ashman. You've certainly come a long way. You have gone from simple larceny and battery all the way to homicide and arson. Hey, they attacked me. Are you here to broaden your resume? Do you remember me? So he knows. I'll never forget a face. Maybe because I don't have one anymore. Uh-oh. So we saw you in the beginning of it. Oh, okay, there we go. There's the, that's the demo. That's pretty cool. It has a little bit of jank. Hopefully it gets sorted out. I have a hard time turning. It's probably because I'm using not using a controller. It seems to be favored to controllers. Um, you know what I'm thinking? Hear me out here, you guys. So you have those two girls in the beginning, right? Lynn and Jennifer. And this, that beginning section took place some years before the first game. Rosemary is looking for Celeste Felton's daughter, adopted daughter. Um, what if Jennifer that you're playing in this game is Rosemary or Lynn is Rosemary? Because they have almost a similar st um, Bob style when they were kids. And maybe if Jennifer is Celeste going under a pseudonym in this ho um, place after she ran away. Um, if Jennifer is Celeste, and Lynn is Rosemary, or Jennifer is Rosemary, and Lynn is Celeste. I think it's the other way around. I think Jennifer is Celeste, and Lynn is Rosemary. But I guess we'll see until the full game comes out, which I will be covering. Don't you worry about that. My name is Miss Scarlet Tanager, and I have been playing some Remothered Broken Porcelain Demo, and I'll see you all in another Let's Play.